Welcome to my ICD class, everyone. Hope you are doing fine and have a healthy life. Everyone, uh, we are going to do the ICD worksheet. Everyone bring out your ICD worksheet, pencil. And let me share you who hasn't done the ICD worksheet so far. And I want to see who has not done their ICD assessments. First of all, explain it to me. Did you guys submit me your project like a presentation? I have shared with you. You guys have to do the notepad work and then what you're gonna do is present it like just like you are explaining in the class. Let me share a video of you then how can you present a video? I have already shared a sample video. What you're gonna do is someone is making a video of you and you were explaining it to him that, hello, assalamu alaikum, my name is Amna and I'm going to present you today about how you can take precautions on coronavirus. Okay? Now tell them the first point is very important and it is about this and this and that. Then second about is second point is about this and this and that. And third point is about this and this and that. Continue till the end and say, I hope you are feeling well and take care of yourselves. Allah Hafiz. Just like that, you have to end this video. And share it to me as soon as possible because the deadline is tomorrow and I have to mark, give you the marks according to that. So everyone submit it before the deadline so that I can give you marks. The 25 marking is your assessment and 25 is your practical project submission. The video you are going to send it to me, okay? Okay, everyone, is that clear to you? Yes? Any questions? Raise your hand if you have any questions. Yes, Abraham. First, your hand is raised. Raise your hand with the Zoom, please. Zoom. Teacher? Yes, Abraham. Teacher, there will be which class? Hai? ICD. Today is an ICD class. Anything else, Abraham? No? Okay, next question. Who is Muhammad Ali? You have raised your hand. Yes, Muhammad Ali. Unmute. Yes, Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali, I cannot hear you. Can you hear me? Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali, can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Yes, you have yes, raised teacher. Question. Is there any question you want to ask? No. Okay, then. Anyone else want to ask any question? Okay then, Aisha Ahmed, Javeria Fatma and Muhammad Ali, please open your camera. Javeria Javed, I can see you clearly now. Nice, nice. Very nice. Very nice. Oh my God, Muhammad Ali is lying down. Is this a class or is this a sleeping class? Sit down properly, Muhammad Ali. Sit on a proper chair, in a proper manner. Just like everyone is sitting. Doya, are you lying down also? Sit properly. Let's play a game, everyone. Let's wait a one minute and let's play a game. We are going to do the parsing and parcel. I will call the name and I'll give you a parcel. Just throw that to someone else and with the name, okay? I will throw something with you and throw. And you should throw it just like that. For example, imagine I have a ball and I'm going to throw it to my Ali Ahmed. Catch it. Ali Ahmad, you have to, yes, just like this. Good job, Ali Ahmad. Now, Ali Ahmad, it's your turn. I'm going to unmute you all. So, unmute everyone, but don't uh, just uh, talk, okay? Just play the game. Don't talk too much so that we can talk easily. Everyone unmute and just throw the ball. Okay, teacher. Name. Ali Ahmad, you have to call the name also. Who is you going to throw the ball? Louder. Yes, you are going to throw the ball to whom? 
Pass, pass, pass. I'm going to throw the ball to Zoya now. Zoya, catch. Very nice. Zoya, throw the ball to someone else. Yes, Tazbiya. Tazbiya, catch. Very nice, Tazbiya. Now throw the ball to someone else, Tazbiya. Call the name and throw the ball. Amar. Amar, catch the ball. Very nice. Now, Amar, throw the ball and call the name. Unmute your mic, Amar and Javeria Javed, Aisha Kamran. Yes, Amar, throw the ball and call the name. Let's go, baby. All right, Amar, open your microphone, please. Unmute yourself. Amar. Throw it to someone. Amar, throw the ball to someone. He is throwing, but he is not mentioning the name. Javeria Fatma, assume why you throw the ball. Javeria Fatma, catch the ball. Catch the ball. Amar has thrown the ball to you. Very nice. Javeria Fatma, throw the ball and call someone. Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali, catch the ball. Mama Ali, catch the ball. Very nice. Now, Mama Ali, throw the ball and call the name. Very fast. Throw the ball, Mama Ali, and call the name. Everyone smiling. Ali Abad. Two eyes. Aisha Kamran. Aisha Kamran, you got the ball. Catch it. Catch. Catch the ball. That's how you're gonna catch it. Catch it. Just imagine you catch are getting it. the ball. Very nice. Now throw the ball to someone else. Those who are not in the list, those who didn't catch it, throw it to the person. Aisha. Aisha will catch the ball. Wow, that's good. That's nice. Now I should throw the ball to someone who didn't get the ball. Throw it to someone who didn't get the ball. Javeria Javed. Javeria Javed, it's your turn. Catch the ball. Javeria Javed, catch the ball. Javeria, hello? Javeria, wow, that's good. Javeria, now throw the ball to someone who didn't in the list. All of you are done. That's the end of the game. Thank you so much for playing. Tapping everyone. Good job. Nice. Well done. Well done. Now you can play next time. Now you can play next time. Okay. I'm muting everyone. Since we are done with the playing and show me the worksheet. Let's do the worksheet now. Let's do the ICD worksheet. It's time for study. Yes. Worksheet, ICD worksheet. Let me see, have you done all the worksheets? Hurry up, hurry up, open it and show it to me. ICD worksheet, who's going to show it to me, ICD worksheet? Yes, ICD worksheet, who's going to show it to me? Everyone. Bring out your ICD worksheet. Yes, yes, hurry up. Okay, today I'm going to share you a video. I've been thinking about something. We have so many cool gadgets nowadays. iPads and laptops and smart mobile phones. So how come we can hardly ever use them at school? Who decides that we? Are people are supposed to learn. Going to ask Can you use the team. tools we're most comfortable with? Use of these gadgets is abbreviated to ICT, Information and Communication Technology. Everyone, after this video, I'm going to ask the question. So be prepared to answer me and pay attention to it, what they are saying. Okay, are you ready? One, two, three, and go. 
I've been thinking about something. We have so many cool gadgets nowadays. iPads and laptops and smart mobile phones. So how come we can hardly ever use them in school? Who decides that we, the people are supposed to learn, can't even use the tools we're most comfortable with? Use of these gadgets is abbreviated to ICT, Information and Communication Technology. In fact, many people believe that children learn much better by using ICT, but many local authorities struggle to provide their students with this. The problem is not the actual hardware. The schools are full of it. The problem is how to use ICT smartly to improve learning. But why is better learning important? Well, and we just like to think they are the best. However, the truth is that even though Norway spends more money on schools than most countries, Norwegian students score average on international peace and Tim's tests. Why is it like that? And what are the consequences? Norway currently makes a good living from its oil. However, it could all be gone by as soon as 2030. People say that after the oil, we will live of knowledge. As far as I can see, this means that more of us will have to get a good education. But with so many of our young people dropping out of high school, can we really claim that we're on the right path to become a knowledge-based society? It doesn't look like it. Are we just expecting our students to suddenly realize that they are the nation's future and get their act together? Or should we try to make schools more relevant and motivating for students so that this happens naturally? If more students learn better, would that possibly motivate them to continue and not drop out of high school? Wouldn't that actually help to create a knowledge-based society? Okay, if we agree that society benefits from improved learning, how do we reach this goal? Well, then we're back to the gadgets. I believe it would be smart to take advantage of students' interest in ICT. Computers can teach us to learn things in different ways. And they also make learning advanced concepts easier, if that's what you want. Imagine, instead of reading about DNA molecules and cramming in facts you don't really understand, why not visualize, simulate, and animate the DNA molecule? Wouldn't this make school more exciting? If you actually understand what you learn? How about math? Wouldn't learning improve if formulas were brought to life using dynamic graphs? Rather than struggling with cryptic X's and Y's? And how about other subjects? Would it inspire us to have all the information in the world at our fingertips just a few mouse clicks away? I think it would. I feel excited just thinking about it. So what's holding us back? Well, ICT is a part of the curriculum as a fifth basic skill. That's a good start. But the curriculum itself is no guarantee, because nothing happens to those who don't follow it accurately. Therefore, it's probably more important to get the actual teachers into the idea of using ICT in their lessons. Could increased use of ICT in teacher training encourage teachers to use ICT in their own lessons? And what if they were given the time and resources to keep their ICT knowledge up to date? Wouldn't that pay? Yes, that's what I'm talking about, everyone. That what you're going to do is you have to do all the subjects work with the help of ICT. Now you can do math with the help of calculator on your um, computer. Now you can solve a lot of ideas of science with the help of internet search. And you can also go to the history, geography, and a lot of things with the help of ICT. So in the next class, you will learn how to do internet searches and how you can make a presentation on MS Word or PowerPoint, okay? Today, uh, I have teach you that how can you make a presentation on Notepad. Notepad, mein aapne kaise kaam karna hai? you have to write it down, your daily schedule or your weekly schedule. Okay, everyone, next time, whenever we take class, I want every one of you to write me your weekly schedule. Okay, your weekly schedule. Next time, I want every one of you to show me what you have done the whole week. 
write it down that I have gone this thing. I have done, I have gone Monday over there. I have gone Tuesday over there. I was working Wednesday on this topic. I have done homework on Thursday. Okay, just like that. A little bit of timetable on your notepad. Okay, uh, Muhammad Ali, please sit down properly. Yes, please sit down. Any one of you have a question? Yes, Javeria, Javed, you have a question. Javeria, first of all, use the reaction in the Zoom available, okay? I will share you for Javeria how everyone you can use the Zoom. Everyone look over here. Yes, you have a zoom reaction on the right side of your panel. Reactions, reactions, watch it and you can use it as a thumbs up or hand raise or a clap in also. Yes, wow, what a beautiful drawing, Javedia. Very nice. Take a picture of it with your smiley face and send it to me on the group. Can you do that? Everyone, those who are done with this artwork, take a picture. Very nice, Zainab. Take a picture of it and send it to me on the WhatsApp. Okay, I will be waiting for your pictures, very beautiful pictures on the WhatsApp. I want every one of your drawing pictures on WhatsApp. Javedi Fatma, Javedi Javed, Zainab Raz. Every one of you share your pictures with me on WhatsApp. Can you do that, everyone? Yes, yes, thank you. Already Amar, uh, no, Ali Ahmed and Muhammad Ali has done the sharing. Now, Jamiya Father, very nice, very pretty. Ali Ahmed and Muhammad Ali has done the sharing the picture with me. Please, Javeria Fatma. Oh, wow, it's a very beautiful Zoya. Very nice, Javeria, and very nice, Javeria Javed. I have seen your three. Zainab, I have seen yours also. Take a picture of it and send it to me on the WhatsApp. Or if you want me to take it right now, I have, I'm taking an ICD class, so I'm not taking the picture, okay? So you can send me the picture on the WhatsApp group. Consider it, I, I'm seeing it. It's like a cheating in an ICD class. You, you are making me cheating so that I can see you taking an art class also. Okay, let's play a game. Yes, Mom, Ali Ahmed, can you tell me what is the mean of ICD? What is the full form of ICD in this video I've shown you? Unmute your mic. ICT. In the video, they have explained you what is the ICD is. ICT. ICT. Yes. Anyone else? Anyone who has the answer, raise your hand. Muhammad Ali. Yes. The full. Your, repeat it again. Your microphone is up. I cannot hear you. Anyone hearing uh, a Muhammad Ali? Muhammad Ali, I'm not hearing it. Repeat it again. No, I cannot hear you. Muhammad Ali, sit properly and then speak in front of the mic. Yes. Yes, please. Answer me with the help of microphone. Close your mouth. Muhammad Ali, I cannot hear you. Let's take another one. Anyone is hearing? Hello, I have a, can you hear me everyone? Thumbs up if you can hear me. Thumbs up. Okay, it's showing that I have some problem over here with the network. Everyone, sorry. I think I need to close the class and rejoin again, but it will be hectic for you to join again and again. Javeria Fatma, I'm going to unmute your mic. If you have a question, everyone, you can unmute one by one, please. Uh, I'm facing a problem over here. So unmute your mic one by one, okay? Once is, everyone is done, close your mic also. 
Teacher, yes. I can tell you answer. Yes, what is the answer, Javedia Javed? Information computer technology. Very good, but the uh, answer is not properly correct. The answer is information and communication technology. You are very close, Javedia Javed. Good, well done, well tried. Everyone, the ICD information and communication technology information is what you get information from mobile computer laptop tab anything with the help of communication you and i communicate with the help of a group conference call or you can do the communication with the help of a computer by searching anything you like to do or you want to do the communication like you can do shopping online you can buy food online you can do play games online you can also search information online so these are all the means of communication okay so wow you know, thank you for reminding me we have a worksheet to do everyone show me the worksheet in the five minutes we have you have to show me that you have done the worksheet of all pages thumbs up if you have done the all pages of the worksheet those who are not done with the worksheet raise your hand and ask me the question if you have thumbs up if you've done the whole worksheet and raise your hand if you have any question or you haven't done any worksheet. Ali Ahmed done, Javed Javed done, Zoya Khan done, Tazbia done. Aisha Amir, are you done with the worksheet? Amar yeah. done also. Roma done, very nice. Zainab, are you done with the worksheet? Unmute your mic and mute your mic as per your questions. If you, are not, if you don't have a question, mute your mic by yourself. Mute your mic by yourself. Roma and Javed, Javed, if you don't have a question, mute your mic by yourself. Mute, just like unmute. You have a microphone symbol on your Zoom meeting. You can click on it and it will show you the symbol of crossing and it will be red. That means you have unmute your mic. That's like it. Good, Javedia. Good, Roma. Javedia, Tazbia, you have any question? You are done. Not Okay, then mute your mic and done with the question. That's very nice. Very nice. Everyone, I hope you have guys will have a very nice eat. And uh, I think Sabne Bakhreed ki tayari kar li hai. Everyone has cow or goat whenever you uh, are ready. Yes. Cow. What? What? Sorry. You have two cow. You have two cow. Wow. Very nice. Yes, everyone is busy with the cow. Joanna Frost, very nice. You have tried it. Very nice. Very good. Very good, everyone. I will be seeing you next time. You have a presentation today. You have to send it to me tomorrow. Till tomorrow, you have a time. What you're going to do is make a, a presentation on the notepad. Write it down on the notepad and then present it like video of you. Make a, someone make a video of you and you are presenting your thing in front of class. Okay, introduce yourself first that I, my name is this and I'm from class this. And uske baad aap ne apni presentation start karni just like, oh, today my topic is precautions of a coronavirus. And I'm going to tell you what are the important precautions. And there's one, two, three, until then you have to explain it in one point. And then yes, say thank you, Allah Hafiz. Teacher. Yes. Teacher. Yes. So presentation, uh, presentation. presentation pe deni hai. No, you can make a yeah. video and send it to me on your WhatsApp. Send it to me on WhatsApp. You have to type in on notepad and then make someone uh, and you in front of a computer sit over there and give the presentation just like you sit in a classroom. Make a video. Teacher. Everyone listen. Teacher. To the listen, listen Teacher. everyone. Teacher. Yes, the video. In my county, camel is come. Wow, nice. Now everyone listen to me. You have to give me presentation like in video format. Write it down the 10 precautions in notepad first. Then Make a video of you explaining that like I have shared a sample video. Go to the sample video and see it. The girl is... 
the girl is in standing in front of a computer and she is explaining that this is the part this is over this and this is this you have to do the presentation like this start with your name that hello assalamu alaikum my name is samna hasan and today i am going to explain it to you the precautions of a corona virus now i have written down the presentation number point, first point is this second is this third is this and fourth is this so on till the 10 and then in the end you have to say thank you allah hafiz make this video tell your parents or your siblings to make a video of you like this and send it to me on the whatsapp whatsapp okay you have tomorrow you have time till tomorrow send it to me by tomorrow no more time you have to send it to me by tomorrow if you have any questions regard or question answers aisha amir you have to do the online question answers assessment which i have already shared the link go to the assessment link just you have to click on the link and do the question answer yes aisha main aapne jo bhi baat kahi hai ki ye karna hai aap wo main personal pe bhej dega agar aapke paas mein personal wala nahi hai to aap group pe ye bata de this is all the group already you are not watching the group continuously I have already uh, done the writing these things on the group. I have sent all these details on the group with the sample video how to do the video presentation. Okay. Thank you, Miss. No problem. Anyone else? Yes, Tasbia. Miss, which question answers? Yes. Yes, Tasbia. What is your question? Which questions answer? Questions can answer what target as well. Complete your sentence. Teacher, kab mana ke dena? The project presentation must be sent by tomorrow. After tomorrow, I won't accept it. Thirty first July is the last day. Make a presentation, write it down on the notepad, and send it to me by tomorrow night. Tomorrow, tomorrow, twelve o'clock. You have time till tomorrow. 12 o'clock. Okay, everyone. Send it to me because it is a 25 <laughs> marks. It is a 25 marks project. So everyone has to send it to me. Um, if you cannot make a proper presentation, it doesn't matter. Just send it to me. Try to be a good look presentation. Yes, you can also show your hairs and try to think that you are giving presentation in an office. Assume yourself that you are giving this presentation in front of so many people. And you are telling them that you have to take precautions, okay? Just like that, imagine this in your imaginary box. And then do the presentation and give me the video. A very cute, very hot, very charming video. Okay, everyone? You smile and explain it to me. You must smile on your presentation, okay? Okay, everyone, I hope you will understand what I'm talking about. Take care of yourself. See you next time in next class. Till then, take care. Allah Hafiz. Happy Mubarak in advance. Allah Hafiz. Allah Hafiz. Allah Hafiz. Allah Hafiz. Yes, Tazbi, I've seen what you have shown me. Very nice. Allah Hafiz. Yes, I saw it. Very nice. Allah Hafiz. Send it to me. Yeah, picture.